microscope, microscope, microscope show. Hi there. Hi, and welcome to Microscope Show. My name is Brent. I'm Doug. And we're back. We got the scope ready to go deep. And today's and episode... Look at some stuff. Today's episode, we'll be looking at bread. Oh, it's bread. got mold on it, too. Oh, great. We got moldy bread. Okay, here's what's going on. We got moldy bread... With seeds all over it. With seeds on it. We've got cheap... This, this is a dollar. This loaf of bread is a dollar. Cheap, bad wheat bread. I've got a croissant here, which costs more than the loaf of bread, actually. It's a croissant. And I also got a Kaiser roll. Permanente. <laughs> so right, this well, is, let's start, let's the start with the... The reason I got the Kaiser roll is because this is a better quality bread than this bread, and we can see the, sort of the difference in quality. So, right. um, so let's... But maybe it's not, and you're, and you're getting tricked and exactly. you pay more. So, what do you want to start with? We'll save the moldy bread for last. Let's that's try the, let's start with the cheapo. Cheap, the cheapo. Cheapo. Now, this is the kind of bread that has, probably has corn syrup in it and stuff. What do the ingredients look like? Um, yep. High fructose corn syrup. Why would a bread need high fructose corn syrup? I don't know. Here's Maybe this. it doesn't really need it. They just... Their buddy is in the fr corn fructose business, you know? Just trying and they're to like, look, I gotta get rid of this corn syrup. I got 500 gallons of this corn syrup. Can you just put it in the bread? Can you get rid of it for me? All right. All right, here we go. 40, here's 40X. Oh, this is actually cool. It actually looks great. It looks like better than cheap bread. You it know looks what I mean? yummy when you go up yeah, close on it. It does. It looks juicy and. They should put this on, wow. the, on the cover of the bag. It almost looks like boogers, almost, or something. In a good way. It looks like juicy boogers in a it good does look, way. It looks really good. It looks like... It actually looks nice. This is how you advertise bread. Yeah. And this is cheap bread. This is bad bread. I should have got the white bread, because this looks so white This right is probably now. all that corn syrup making it. Well, it's so bright. Let's look at the crust here. There's where the bread... That's where the crust turns into the... The transitional like right there, huh? Let's see here. That's where the crust turns into the the white part. By the way, this is a very popular Look at suggestion. That. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Look at that rack rack focus up the crust. It actually looks like artisanal. I gotta say, doesn't it? Doesn't this look like artisanal, good quality bread that you get <laughs> no. in a restaurant or something? They should let me film the commercial for this, and we'll like rack focus and. You know, let us direct the bread commercial for this cheapo bread. Yeah. Look at that. Look at how it's a world you can go inside of and just eat it. <laughs> it's so good tasting. All right. Looking. I mean, that's about it. All right. Okay, now we're going to do a Kaiser roll. Permanente. Well, we'll open it up in a second. Let's look at the outside, though, first. It's, I bet it's all going to look the same once you get this close. It all looks artisanal and good. Now, this is good quality bread. Which was the most expensive thing you bought? Well, this croissant was the most expensive. Okay, this, you know, it's like... I think inside is... looks gonna, like leather. I think inside is where it's at. Let's Want me it. to rip it open? Uh, okay, I was going to do it, but you can do it. Or should we cut it open? Oh, looks good. Let me smell that. I'm getting hungry. Can I smell I'm hungry. Let's eat after this. Mmm, <laughs> I love bread. Mmm, yummy. It just kind of looks like the other bread, but lighter. It's lighter, yeah. Oh my god, this I, I'm, it makes me hungry. Bread makes me hungry. You know, this reminds me of um, I I had this Look roommate in college, and when I say roommate, I mean we shared a room together. Um, he was thirty five years old, and I was eighteen or nineteen years old. But he was from Brazil. He was, was in he, some sort of exchange program. Were you program. in like a dorm room or something? It was a rooming house. And I, sh I shared it with two guys, and they were both doing this sort of exchange, three-month exchange thing. And uh -huh. his name was, well, whatever, it doesn't matter his name was, but he talked, kind of talked like this. He kind of had this high-pitched voice. He's 35 years old. And he would, he, we went to the store once, and for some reason he got fixated on the bread there. And he kept on saying, because he, he got fixated on, on 
the name for bread being the same name as well, close to my name, you know? And he <laughs> said, he just would keep saying, this is my roommate. His name is Brent. Look, Brent, Brett. Brent, <laughs> Brett. He was saying, like, you go like this. Look, Brett, Brent, Brent. Brent, Brent. This is my roommate. His name was Brent. Brent, Brent. Well, you know, in Portuguese, no two words sound alike. So that was must have been mind-blowing. <laughs> right. Him. Trying to go 1,000x, but it's not working. All oh, right. Really? Well, you know what? This is... What about the... What about the transitional? It's not it, the bread is not a great thing here, you know. Oh, that's People nice. People kept asking for it, and I knew it was just gonna be kind of a one. Note. Wait till we get to this moldy bread, huh? Okay. All right, let's see this croissant. Now this is gonna be a flaky situation. Okay, as you can see, this is a darker. It's got a sort of orangey look to it, obviously. I wonder if you, if people saw these without knowing which was which, which one would they choose to eat? That's a great question. You know? That's a great question. This I, is... s I probably would pick this one, but I don't know. I tend to like things that are a little Well, this does almost look colorful. This does I... look like earwax, though, I must say. This reminds me of your earbuds, or your ear pods, or whatever they were. Doesn't it? Kind of looks kind of uh, waxed out a little bit, doesn't it? That looks fully, well, that looks fully I mean, waxed. Croissants are buttery, right? They're they're a buttery pastry. All right, let's rip it open. Get this. Okay, there's the rip. I mean, it was not up here. Oh, here we go. Try to try to find the real rip. Like try, try to find where it's actually ripping. That's kind of flaky and delicious looking. Trying to get a good rip. Here's a good rip right here. I want to see it ripping apart. Is there possible possible to do that? There it goes. Oh, nice. That was great. Oh, that's great, Doug. That's great. Ooh, that it looks delicious. That looks delicious. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> you couldn't you couldn't help yourself. Could help you? it. <laughs> couldn't help it. I'm gonna eat this whole now, thing. now look inside that. Just stick it in oh. there. There's the inside of the croissant. Yeah, it's just sort of like. It's kind of almost. It looks greasier, obviously. You know, it's buttery. Or icy. Uh -huh. like a if glacial. You don't, if, if you don't know what you're looking at, you can think you're you're looking at something from a glacial nature. You know, right. That looks like ice. It does look like ice in a way, doesn't it? Yeah. All right. Well, Can you stick it in to this thing? Just stick it in. I mean, it's the same. It's just the stick same it thing. in. What a world! What a world! What another world! Here's thousand X on the exterior. The thing with Thousand X is it's really kind of shaky, you know. Right. Every micro little movement. Go Thousand X on there. It's it's not a lot of. You know what I mean? It's sort of one wash of mm -hmm. color, so. It's a bit of a wash. It's a bit of a wash. Now, for the coup de gras. <laughs> Moldy bread. Where's the mold? Check it. Oh goodness gravy! I can't. Oh, right oh my God! It's looking Just good. Just pull out the heel. Pull out it's the. It's looking good. Is that called the heel? The last piece of bread. You know what probably doesn't get moldy, by the way, is that cheap bread. <laughs> right. So many chemicals. Well, this is gonna have nuts and mold on, or kind of seeds and and mold on it. This is next to the mold. And look, there's the mold. Wow, there's the mold. It's almost like a web of. Lies. You know what I mean? Like, you see those fibers? Is that web mold fibers? It smells like mold. Look at the... Oh, yeah, wow. Oh, get into that dark mold. That's the mold right there. Get into the dark matter. Hey, can you uh, get closer on that? With the thousands? Oh, 
It's like a snow wonderland. What is mold? Where does it come from? And what does it want? That corner right there. This is thousand X on the mold. You know, it doesn't. Uh, I don't know. Go 40 on it then, I guess. That's a seed right there we're looking at. Huh. And then right next to it is the mold. Well, there you go, folks. You asked for it. You wanted bread. And we did We did look it. Look at that. Ooh, look at that. We went to the bakery. But that's actually kind of cool. It looks like it's just crusted with snow. It looks like some kind of mineral. You know, when you go to, like, the hot springs mm -hmm. and then those rocks have the, yeah. the mineral deposits? It also looks like a storm cloud or something. The mold. Can you do, like, fo focus different parts of it kind of thing? That's interesting. Just, oh, man, you can't, it's not possible to get in there. What huh? are you trying to do? Um... Just get closer. That's about as close as you can get. Yeah. That's cool. That's good. That's a cool album cover. That somebody okay. That brings me to the point I wanted to make. It looks like a Cocteau Twins album cover, <laughs> and I will say this: I've been kind of referencing the wrong Cocteau Twins album. I've been meaning to say Head Over Heels. I keep on saying Sunburst and Snowblind. And actually, it's head over, well, Sunburst and Snowblind kind of looks like this, but this kind of looks like Sunburst and Snowblind. But there's actually, other album covers out there besides Cocteau Twins. There's no way everything you think that looks like Cocteau Twins is a cock, <laughs> looks like a cock. There's no way. Well, Head Over Heels, Head Over Heels, that's the one to check out. Head Over Heels, the album cover, check that out. Okay. And also, it's a good album too, actually, by the way. Well, that's bread. You asked for it. You asked for it. You got it. We went to the bakery. We delivered. You know, and hey, you know what? It was kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and tell us what else to look at. Subscribe to the channel, and also, uh, if you want to see bonus episodes, bonus content, you can go to patreon.com slash microscope show, right? That's right, and we'll see you next week with more scoping. <laughs> more tight scoping. I'm Brent. And I'm Scope. <laughs> we'll scope you next week. Microscope, microscope, microscope show.